Nationwide lockdowns in March and April prompted a new question for many people. Will we experience a baby boom? After all, we spent a lot of time inside. Nine months later, one central Kentucky health care provider says she believes the pandemic did lead to more pregnancies. LX18's Evelyn Schultz introduces us to one Georgetown family who fits that trend. I, I remember whenever we found out we were pregnant in then March, we found out at the beginning of April, and that was right after everything started and everyone was like, oh, so is this a quarantine baby? For Ashley Linden and her husband, Neil, the answer was... Yes, mine was. <laughs> She gave birth to daughter Nora just over a week ago, an early Christmas present at the end of a tough 2020. It was definitely scary in the beginning because we had no idea what the future was going to hold. Turns out a baby boom for their whole family. Ashley's sister-in-law, Caitlin, is pregnant too, due at the end of January. Did we mention their cousin is due in March? We are all pregnant the same time two years ago or yeah two years ago I guess and then we're all three pregnant right now in central Kentucky I am expecting a boom for sure Alicia Morgan is a certified nurse midwife at Lexington Women's Health she says births at their office this month are up 40 percent from the same time in 2019 babies due in January are up 24 percent anytime there's um, a holiday, a snowstorm, anything that happens, we always start, you know, doing the calculations. When's everybody going to start coming in? Morgan says a pregnancy during COVID-19 comes with different challenges. These women know that firsthand, but for their family, it's also proof joy can arrive in the smallest of packages. It's been so enjoyable to be, um, to go through pregnancy with not just a family member, but your sister-in-law. Even when you might not expect it. That's the cherry on top of this whole year. In Lexington, Evelyn Schultz, LEX 18 News. Now, nationally, experts at the Brookings Institution actually predict the opposite of a baby boom. They say the United States will likely experience a baby bust to the tune of about 300,000 fewer babies in 2021. They say multiple factors are at play, including anxiety over COVID-19 and a loss of jobs.